two teams as we're underway on EA Sports. And no run back. Yet to appear in a playoff game, but last year, really solid numbers again. A third straight 4,000 yard campaign, 27 touchdowns, just nine interceptions, and the highest analytical rating of his career. Derek Carr is one of the top quarterbacks in the NFL. Up, and down he goes, but he takes. And I think preseason is officially over now. Getting into the groove of the regular season, that's a great way to get started. First drive of the season, what a nice completion. Looking for Sneed, and it's intercepted. R. Jackson out of Louisville. And 2020 was an excellent season for number eight. Wasn't able to repeat the numbers from his MVP campaign of 2019. From the 34 now, here's first and 10. From the gun, it's Jackson. Flushed out right. And this turns in. Progressions, not there, not there. After about the third one, he decided he better pull it down and run for it. And he slides down and avoids the hit for good measure. We go back to back first down. The run only got a yard. Here's second and nine. And now Jackson will look to throw it. This one caught by his tight end. Situation got out to the tight end. Ryan Justice, he's supposed to be in right now. Opportunity to convert on third down. Where's Justice at? They'll try to run for it with Dobbins. Back to drive going with a six-yard pickup on third down. They'll try and run for it on first and goal. And he's going to... And you want bigger people on the field to try and help against the run. Hill, touchdown, Bolts And the offensive line were in concert. I used to have a coach who called it marrying up. Meaning, when you get on the guy, you just stay yeah, right, right there. And each guy has his own assignment. That allowed the runner to make the big move towards the end zone. Tucker with the extra point, and that makes the score 7-0. Tucker now to kick it away following the touchdown. And this fielded right at the goal line. And just to tell us before every game, the team making the fewest mistakes will win. What they're hoping is that that last mistake is their only one of the game. Coaches, that's all they talk Defense about. Defense just to settle down a little bit after they give up a touchdown. From the 25 on second down, Carr. And this goes out wide for Drake. Well, what's the game plan for going up against him? Yeah, it used to be take away the short stuff, I know, but he's more than a dink and dunker, right? And you are right about that. Great analysis of him because he has evolved as a throw causing problems. Go get him. Here's the first carry for Kenyon Drake. Fights loose. Oh, an absolute. Then in the preseason, a lot of these guys don't play a whole lot. Plus, the intensity and the speed really ratchets up on opening week. This pass from number one, you throw the short game until they stop it. And if they're not going to stop it, you keep throwing it. And occasionally, you'll break a tackle and turn into a bigger gain. Also, if they start to clean a little more than a yard. On play action, now Carr. This one complete to his fullback out of the back. Defender, you just lock in on your target and say, I'm not even thinking about breaking stride. I'm running straight for the belt buckle because where it goes, that's where you find his body. And he was able to get in there and make a great play. On first and ten, here's Carr. The quick slam Carr. Tussler within an extra point of tying this thing up. Like, man, still don't work. Bouncing back nicely from that bad opening drive where he threw the interception. Drive number one. They have. He absolutely must maintain that as a quarterback. But I have to think that they're probably still on the script that they prepared for this game. Finding the end zone on their opening drive of the season. And they'll get another shot here with a first and ten. They'll start on the ground with Dalvins. So be it, but the main goal... Get a couple of first downs, run some plays, run some clock. Let other defense get a chance to catch their breath, settle down, and relax a little bit. They'll throw on first down with Jackson. He'll check this down. The ball has a head of steam come out of the backfield. It could turn into a big play with missed tackles or he runs through people. But they were right there waiting, and they stopped him for a minimal game. And he'll work up. They stay on the ground. This time it's Hill. He just made a great play there. 
On second down now. Dobbins. Dobbins hit and he fumbles. And the Raiders pick it up. And now off to the races. Down the right side. And he's into the So this defense clicking early in the year. Week one, the return for a touchdown. The organization. Extra point by Carlson. Up and good. And that makes the score 14 to 7. And here comes a return from just beyond the goal line. Yep. And you have to be very careful about having too quick of a hook with really good players. I did a guy's game in high school where he fumbled three times in the first quarter. Finished over 300 yards on the night. Complete. Good coverage there. Forced the ball free, and it's second down. On second down in this game, and I thought the ball started to jostle there a little bit, but they got to him quickly at the line of scrimmage. They sure did, and remember, if you're not a very confident runner and you've already dropped it once, Jackson hit. Are you fucking serious? And the Raiders pick it up. That is going to 13 now. They work on first and 10. Carr defers to Jacobs on the draw. He's able to make a nice play there to swallow up the ball carrier. Throwing on second and eight, Carr. That is caught by Brown. Touchdown. They're able to strike quickly to add on to their lead. So a good start to the King. And August getting ready for this game. It's all coming together so far. James Prochet to return it. And, and last time, not only the turnover, but that turned into six points. They got to make up for that here. We always hear about empty possessions, but some are worse than others. You get an empty That's a bad possession all the way around. Yeah, but you're hungry to get back out there, aren't you? You better be, because otherwise, it's going to be a long day for you. Throwing on first down, it's Jackson. And it's seven teams in each conference making the playoffs. This year, the headline, the addition of a 17th regular season game. What did you think when you heard it for a long time? And now here it is. So the beautiful part about all of it is that 17th game is going to be like these, these interdivision, interconference type games that are going to match up. Titles. So here's a first and 10 now in Raider territory at the 47. available on every snap. On second down, it's here. Absolutely. It can be ugly. And in this case, loss of yardage ugly. On third down, Jackson. There. So on fourth down, here's Sam Cook to punt it away. Hunter Renfro deep to return for the Raiders. So they have to put the pedal to the metal, I guess, so to speak. So definitely have them in the rearview mirror, don't they? I <laughs> mean, you're exactly right. Being able to string together these drives that end up in points, it's almost like a run in basketball to create that Here's Jacobs on first and ten. And call like that. So when they do, they go back to their huddle with a little pep in their steps. They're starting to think that they're starting to dominate the line of scrimmage. Second and five now. Carr. Man open. That's Henry Ruggs. And he will score here in the season opener as they're able to extend their lead. For Henry Ruggs, he was the first, and that speed in evidence there. And that's the kind of play where you have to kind of catch your breath afterwards to just give me a second here because when he shifted into high gear, he was a record, folks. Jackson and the Ravens come up now first and 10 at their own 17-yard line. And from the shotgun, he'll throw. Receivers to run free, and there's another example, another incompletion. To throw on second and 10, Jackson. Looking left side, and you that coming up at halftime will hand things off to the coach, Jonathan Coachman in Orlando. He'll have a look back at a very intriguing opening weekend in the NFL. Give it a shot downfield. That one incomplete. They're going on fourth down. It's Jackson. 
eluding the pressure right. And he gets this to him across midfield now for first and ten. Here's Jackson. Slings it to Anders, and it's complete. The tight end. Second and two. Jackson now off the bootleg. Wide open is Watkins. He's got it. It's a first and ten at the 14-yard line. From the gun, a run for Hill. Paint on that last run. Here's second and a couple. Here's Jackson to throw. And in for the Ravens. Touchdown. Ravens get a late score here in the final minute of the first half. Tucker able to finish eight plays. And it's capped off by the Baltimore score. Tucker now to kick it away following the touchdown. Touchdown passes. I would agree with you. There is a blemish. But when you've thrown three touchdown passes to try and erase it, that's a little bit better than the ratio that all NFL coaches blitz hosing quarterback. Make him uncomfortable. And so far, they've not been able to do that. Not at all. He's been really comfortable in the pocket. Three touchdown passes already. So that could be an important first sack if they do want to turn things around. They don't want to repeat a first down. They'll keep it on the ground. Welcome everyone back for quarter number three. We'll see if week one fatigue becomes any kind of a factor. They so, you know, they're down two scores. That's not the end of the world. It wasn't the strongest of first halves, but for them to start calling back, they've got to start putting more pressure on that defense, start cutting into this deficit. You can't have three and outs and expect to get that done. And throwing here to start the drive as they connect left side. And a nice gain of 21 yards. Well, that was a fun one to watch right there. A nice in-breaking route and plenty of room in the middle of the field. And he was able to get behind the linebackers and grab the... 114 yards on the ground for him so far. From just shy of midfield, Jackson. He'll get that to the world. Picks up the first. The play fake to Dobbins. Here's Jackson. Flush to his right. A seven Brings up seven and three. Jackson now. Escaping the pressure right. Jackson, draw play to Dobbins. Jackson. Over the middle. Third down. Jackson. Now he's got it. When you're trailing and find yourself this deep in enemy territory, the kicker's not even part of your thought process. You got to make it pay off. And he'll get in. Excellent work there to get in on the touchdown run. And the Ravens draw a bit closer. As they go nine plays in all. And it's finished off by a touchdown run from J.K. Dobbins. Now to return it, here's Kenyon Drake. And, good score game. and because of that pressure, because it's now a one-score game, they know this is where you need to slow the momentum change because otherwise that could overrun your head taking place on that play because he saw he had a receiver in the area. He just put it well over his head out of harm's way. And he'll be taking the passing situation. Throwing his car on third down. And that'll be checked down to Drake. Convert to win football games. We're in the third quarter of this one, and this is a tight one. In order to maintain pace, keep the ball away from the other team, and put points on the board, those are the plays they need to continue. They guessed correctly that they would move the ball on the ground, honed in on it, and stopped them. Mark that down for a win in the defense's column. They've got to think about, I'm not going to say milking the clock, 
but understanding clock management here on out. Car now to throw. Let's go, man. Knowing that they needed to get a stop, they're in a tight ball game, on, and they got it done. Great work to force the three and out. Got the football right back for their offense. They've got to prepare for tired, those encounters because you know they'll make some adjustments. They begin to drive with him. Allen's at the line of scrimmage. He had the most space to try and run. Really nice job swarming to the ball carrier. On second and nine, Jackson. It's complete to the right side. And they're making more catches like the one we just saw there. The routine variety. Off the play fake. Here's Jackson. Uh, up a pretty good chunky yardage, but right there, they got a good portion of it right back. And if we just flip it around from the offensive perspective, took a nice yeah. step forward. And how about a backwards? After that, how about that for a chain mover? They're all the way down to get down. inside the 40 now for yeah, first and 10. You heard, you heard what I said. Now it's Jackson. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Finds his two yeah. and a half here outright. Uh, the offensive coordinator uh, scheming his guy open. Just a little uh, underneath route, just trying to free up some space. And it worked awfully well. Yeah, I'm not just you know, sitting here as we wrap up the week on a Monday night. We'll return with more after this break. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. He's got the first. And you can see his eyes light up as he realizes there's absolutely no one in front of him. He takes off and goes. He got a space for him. Good job. He didn't get the push they needed. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I'm about to tell you, you can't show that my hand. Just to go for two, but I'd go ahead and kick this one and just get it back to level. Tied so it up. Right back to Time to play defense. One. Tied at 28 as he kicks it away. Oh, he brought it out. A couple yards deep, he'll bring it out of the end zone. That's the bad news. The good yeah. news. Plenty of time in this fourth quarter to try to grab that lead back. They'll begin on the ground with Jacobs. Second and six. But you heard me though. Don't you bite me. You cheating, bro. They'll stay on the ground with Jacobs. And turning into a nice run. And a lot of times you think if you blitz a running play, you're going to smother but a lot of the blitzers, they come Wow! Right there. Some pretty good yeah, games all the weekend. We may have saved the best for last. This Monday night game has been a dandy. Car completes it. And he's taking... No, I'm not. You're trash it. No. I am. Now Car. And he good. Get back some real estate. Felt like the type of play that can spark a defense and swing some momentum. Almost felt like a take that type of a play, didn't it, partner? The pass to Brown as he holds it in. And let the quarterback find you. And that's exactly what they did on that play. First with the pass through the air. Nice chunk of yardage there. And then additional pickup with his legs after the catch. This pass from Kiggins targets not go. only on his team go. in the yep. National Football Here we go. And you and I both know the quarterbacks love these large body tight ends, and why not? Nowadays, they're really wide receivers who are Raiders on third down. Good. Three for four. Four. This is third and four. Whoa. To throw its car. Whoa. 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 I like that. Yeah. Bring up what I think for the offense. Down here. Carlson able to put first chance in the ball game, and it didn't come until the fourth quarter. But he connects there, a big one to give him the lead. Boy, you talk about coming in cold. I don't care how many times you kick it into the net. Gets it in the Ravens coming up now. First and ten at their own twenty-two. They start the drive on the ground with Hill. Pulls him off the offense right now. Bam, boom, biff. That's how they feel good about moving the football. Play action. Now Jackson. 
Oh, looking for Andrews downfield. 36 yards. So how about that for a chain mover? They're all the way down inside the 40 now for first and 10. Nothing doing. The right path to the ball carrier. On second and nine, Jackson. This one caught by his tight. Jackson on the give to Dobbins. Good. Set up to keep making first downs, keep the clock running. And if they're smart, you're starting to milk the clock. No hurry before you run your second down play. Throw left side complete. That's Andrew. Good. Good football here as we welcome you back. They come up on a first and goal with this game still hanging in the balance. I don't want that. You over here cheating. They'll try to run with Dobbins. And they he just scored it. There for third time. No one likes to have the hat trick against them. I can't get you up. Right Try to run oh, with Dobbins. See the game here, trailing in the final quarter and going for it on fourth and goal. Here we go. It's Jackson on fourth down. Eluding, and he's a crushed <laughs> ball because that score. They might want to try to rush back into this stadium. <laughs> yeah. well, Let's looks go. Like it's going to be the game deciding score. Tucker now to kick kill. it away, following the touchdown. Twenty-eight to six. Barely. And what time? I'm gonna keep my ass right here on the line. Right there. Nope. Car. You seen the games I've been through? Nope. Get in there, guy. Now a desperation throw deep downfield. He's on the first row. And just keep that call. That'll bring up second down. The way he's throwing the football today, almost a surprise when he doesn't complete a pass like happened there, but he needs a few more to get his guys downfield. Well, the way he's thrown it leads him to believe That's that he's it. going to That's get those completions. And that means the guys going out with passes oh, don't run even harder game, because they expect it as well. Now a deep ball there on second down, but it'll wind Let's up go. incomplete. So the final seconds tick eight, away in eight, this Baltimore eight, victory. Eight, eight, and partner, eight, I must eight. say, good to see you again. Been too long. And it's good to have football back, isn't it? Didn't you see me in preseason? Weren't we together in preseason? Yeah, but preseason, you know, it's preseason. This is week one. Oh, you're trying to say real football. Yeah, real football. Not preseason football where we shake down the rosters and figure out who's going to play. And maybe the starters don't play as much. Now it's the front line guys from the first whistle. Yeah, I tuned.